Welcome back to the studio, everyone. So glad you're here. Today I have something a little bit different for you. It's a two-part series. I've challenged myself to create an image of a pink cockatoo, an animal that I think is just stunning and will make a beautiful subject for what I'm going to do. I will create this first using paint the image and then I will take the same image and create it using wool. If you've been around here for a little while and watched some of my videos, you know that wool needle felting is something I just discovered and become very passionate about. Ironically, it's very similar to the painting process. So one can inform the other. So I think by painting it first, will only inform my process and my method for making it in wool. So I hope you sit back and relax and enjoy the unfolding of the pink cockatoo. I will leave it here for you to watch and then I'll join you in the end and fill you in about the part two video. Enjoy.
So there we have it, the finished painting, my pink cockatoo. I couldn't be happier. I really took liberty on some of these colors and I'm really happy I did because it kind of sets it apart and gives it a real style that I'm really crazy about. And I'm excited to recreate this in wool. So I hope you'll stay tuned for part two of this series where I take you through my process of how I take this image and recreate it using the medium wool. And as of now, which is May 25th, it is available for purchase on my website, this painting and the wool painting. So I hope you go over there and check it out. And as always, thank you for watching. I hope you'll share this video with somebody you think can get enjoyment from it. And give it a thumbs up, it really helps my channel. Until next time, I hope you find serenity through your creativity. Thank you.